all right y'all so coming to you bare faced and <laughs> fabulous i literally just did my skincare routine using the new fenty skin face scrub y'all have waited for this video to come out and i finally am here with a review y'all were asking me to do this before we get into all of that make sure you hit the subscribe button like this video join the vibe squad so let's get straight into the vibes of this latest skin video all right y'all so this is a detox scrub that won't do you wrong okay those are words straight from the site if you don't believe me i didn't make those up okay it claims to have a unique lightweight texture that effectively polishes exfoliates and retexturizes the skin instantly reduces the appearance of pores and blackheads um, surface oil and fights shine leaving the skin feeling soft and smooth not dry or irritated those are some of the claims of this particular scrub this scrub has a very pillowy light texture so i knew that this was going to be a i knew that the scrub was going to lay nicely on the skin so in this scrub it says there's volcanic sand and silica charcoal of course salicylic acid um, you have ginger, you have rhubarb, and you have a bentonite clay. Those are pretty much ingredients that we all can read and may know and love. And then you have the rest of your ingredients that get a little bit more complicated. And those will also be linked to the site that I will have in the description box if you want to know more about the ingredients. So just want to get into a little information when it comes to scrubs or mask even, but scrubs and masks, like you want to use it two to three days a week it's not something you want to use every single day um just want to know take that because i get a lot of people asking me those questions and yeah girl you want to spread it out okay because you don't want to keep stripping your skin you want your skin time to be able to turn itself over also interested in the reduction of blackheads because i get a lot of blackheads on my nose and i'm really not a fan of that so here i'm going to show you guys actually washing my face with the scrub and i'm really getting into the feel of this face scrub it has a very lightweight feel it is very similar to the mask however again we'll get into the comparison um we'll get into the differences with the mask in just one second um, instantly, I felt like it was exfoliating. It wasn't heavy at all. I felt like it did its job. It was sinking nicely into the skin. Um, and you could see here where I wash it off, no problem. It wasn't sticking to the skin. Um, it didn't doesn't have a crazy smell to it. And it was really easy to use on the face. The price point of this face mask is $32, which in my opinion is pretty standard pricing. Um, it is 3.52 ounces. So you get quite a lot. Again, you're not using this every single day. So I feel like this is a nice size. Let's go back to the claims after washing my face. It claimed that it would reduce the look of pores. I do feel like it did that. I really feel like it cleaned out the blackheads that I have. Um, you know around the nose area reduces surface oil and fights shine now keep in mind here on my face now i put on um all the things so my face does have a bit of a shine my washing of the face video i feel like um that shine is isn't there um my skin also is very smooth afterwards again i liked that there was no pulling or tugging on the skin and my skin wasn't turning like flaming hot cheeto red that some of the scrubs do when you use it even if you're using it in a gentle way sometimes they can really make your skin irritated definitely not dry for reference again my skin tends to run on the drier side it's starting to crawl into the more normal skin type but i still classify it as dry until listen once that skin is a hundred percent normal that's when i'll come on here and be like my skin is normal i will proudly say my skin is normal because if you have normal skin you are yes yes you are <laughs> so i feel like it's trying to crawl over there but um it still rides on the drier end so my skin did not turn out more dry after using the scrub uh, of my dry skin girlies i know that can be an issue for us and personally i didn't have that issue when trying the scrub
everyone when the mask came out they were begging for the mask re where's the mask where's the mask when are you coming with the mask when are you getting the mask like the mask the word mask was used so many times like you look mask up in the dictionary i guarantee you fenty is under it i feel as if it does very similar things that the mask does here is the scrub here is the mask again i can show you guys a comparison of them uh, side by side and you guys can see the textures so first of all the colors are different the textures are both very pillowy but I find that the mask has a little more denseness to it um, they both do similar things they have the charcoal beads in it they have similar claims to them however the mask is more of a if you have more time and you're doing your skincare routine because it's considered to be more of a 10 minute face mask versus the scrub is something that you would use um, on your skin and wash away and can go about your day. It's not something you have to leave on your skin and wait 10 minutes for. It's just a normal scrub and it works just like any other scrub would. So those are pretty much the differences between the two again i'm not saying the mask is not lightweight i just find it to be a little more dense and for a mask personally i don't mind that neither one have crazy sense to it they're in my opinion gentle on the skin again that's my skin and what i deal with i cannot talk I cannot speak for people who are fighting certain issues or acne the scrub and the mask work both really well out of the two which are my favorite i'm gonna keep it real honest with y'all i'm not always the best at doing my skincare routine i have recently been doing it like every night and getting into it more and more and making sure i am making my face more hydrated so i don't always opt for the 10 minute situation i don't always feel like i have that kind of time i would go more for this um it's just faster i can get to my skincare and be done with it as far as using the mask and the scrub together it is something that you can do you can use them both together but you want to use it on non-consecutive days i won't be using them together i don't feel the need to use them together but some people do some people like to have more products um, really going on their face and really making sure that the blackheads are gone, that all the things are gone. But I also have found that using this scrub, I didn't feel the need to use the mask on top of that. So I was able to go about my normal skincare routine. I like simple. <laughs> I don't always have time to be doing a 20 step routine. Let me know in the comments if you are going to pick this scrub up if you've already picked it up let me know i already know i'm a little bit late here so i'm sure some of you have already gotten your hands on it let me know what y'all think about this scrub hope so y'all hope you enjoyed this review let me know if you have any questions in the comments below of course i will have everything listed in the description box as i usually do and yeah thank y'all so much hey to the new subbies i see y'all there have been an influx of y'all coming through introduce yourself in my comments i love intros i love chit chatting with y'all i love when y'all vibe with me this is a vibe channel we're here to bring community together so that is the point of why we are here and yeah if you like this hit subscribe like the video i love you guys so so much and i'll catch you guys in my next vibe video bye